We'll get a local matchup in college as well this week. OSU and TU in the Turnpike Classic. Both seem to struggle in week one. Now we're going to get a blazing hot stage for what was a pretty tight game in 2020. Let's flash back to that game. It was dominated by defense. And of course, Zayvon Collins making his presence known. Well, Collins is going to be getting ready for his pro debut on Saturday. So that leaves TU figuring out how to stop that OSU offense, presumably with their suspended starters returning for week two. That's what Mike Gundy's looking at when game planning. He is not underestimating TU despite that one week loss. When you have as many suspensions as they do, it's going to greatly affect your team. I'm, I'm sure they don't just feel like they can run two groups out on both sides of the ball and feel comfortable with their experience and ability to compete at a high level. I don't have that luxury here. Okay, and, and uh, as, as we just talked about, the general fans and population and public, they, they don't like that, but they don't really know how much that affects your team, which is a bunch. Okay, and I'm guessing these guys are back now. 